right here accelerate out. I always suggest to stay on the right side completely. Yeah. Because there is a faster car so we're taking you. Because yeah. ideal line is aiming for the left part of the bridge but you only win like one or maximum two seconds with it if you take the ideal line here. But it's better to let all the faster traffic pass. Stay on the right completely and once you're in the compression, so in the bottom, start steering towards the left curbs too nicely. Speed is okay, no need to brake. Okay. It's all fine. Towards the left curb stone gently. After that, the right curb stone so in a straight line. Yeah, like that to the right curb, and then to the left side of the track. So to the left corner. Now we're on the brake and then steering uh, in. Okay. Yeah, and now braking straight in the straight line. And then aiming towards the right curb stone, and then left curb stone, and after that, stay left. So left okay. curb. Stay left at the traffic sign, tap on the brake and steer in. Yeah, and steer in. Yeah, and to the left side, to the outside. Take this one, okay. nice and easy. You're one of the few people who has taken this corner the way you should do, because right. a lot of people do it too, too late. At the right, orange barrier on the brakes. Yeah, and then steering into the left. Curve Inside the or yeah, yeah, yeah. The, no, the, don't pay attention okay. to the okay. to the gearing. No, it doesn't matter. We're just doing the lines now only. Aiming towards the right curb stone, and then two kilometer sign, and once you're at the sign, you can start steering right. So stay close to the sign, and now to the right side. Yeah, speed is okay. Right curb stone, left side of the track, left corner of the track. Yeah, and moving over to the right side, there are two braking points incoming. So here on the brake, and yeah, let go, steer in, and brake again, and right. let go, steer in. Yeah, exactly. Always important to have straight line braking. Aiming to the left curb stone, after that the orange barrier, at the right curb stone you go on the brake a bit and steer in right. So orange barrier, yeah, but brake, steer in, left curb, right curb. Yeah. Very nicely done, right curb, and then 3 km sign, perfectly done, and now a bit on the brakes. Yeah, and steering in, close to the curb stone, keep it tight, keep it tight. And then left curb, and then small window in the fence, over there, yeah, and then middle of the track. And once you're completely uphill, stay close to the right barrier. Yeah, let the car pass, the GTR taxi. Oh. <laughs> yeah. And then aiming towards the left side of the track. And uphill, as you can see, you can optionally brake, but to the speed it's okay. It's okay. And at the orange barrier, start steering right. So it's a double right-hander, so to the right curb zone, then to the left side of the track, and back to the right curb zone. With the same input. Right? Yeah, exactly, so same steering input. Down the left curb stone, and you can move out to the middle of the outside and back to the left curb stone. It all depends on your speed. And aiming towards the right upper corner of the track. You can see there, in a straight line as possible. At exclamation mark, you go on the brake, and a 5 km side, you let go. That's the safest way to do it. So here on the brake, yeah, here let go, and go on the throttle again to the left side. Always important to go on the throttle here. And end of left curb stone, you go on the brakes in a straight line. So here on the brakes, straight line braking, perfect then. And now to the right curb, and then to the left curb stone. So from here you go on the throttle again to the left side of the track. A small white sign, the 93 over there. And from here start steering left gently to the 6 km side. Straight towards it. Yeah, and now gently to the left, to the left curb stone, then the right curb stone at the end of the right curb. Steer gently to the left curb stone and right curb stone. So from here, always important never brake at the bottom, never let go of the throttle at the bottom. Always do it either before or after. At the sign, steering in, yeah. Aiming towards the right curb on the brakes a bit. Yeah, and you can either stay right completely or just aim towards the orange graffiti. So you can stay right and at orange graffiti, steer in left. So steer. Um, yeah, that's very slippery here, as you can feel. Yeah, <laughs> yeah nicely to catch. <laughs> Good, aiming towards the left curb stone over there, and after that, right curb stone. You can usually just accelerate out. Left curb, right curb, after right curb, steering was straight to the left side of the track. Okay. Yeah. Once you're at the left side, you go on the brakes towards the right side. Or oh, okay. Yeah, it's all fine. And then now you can start steering to the left curb stone, and then to the right side of the track. At the end of the right curb, you go on the brake, and the beginning of left curb, you steer in. Right curb stone and left Yokohama sign. Yeah. And at the motorcycle sign you go on the brake and you stay left almost until the barrier. Stay, 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 because as you can see here is dry surface. When it's wet you stay completely on the outside. Aim towards the 
right fence and at the right fence you just tap on the brake for the weight distribution and yeah enough and you see it was the left curb right curb left fence yes stay left and now on the brakes again and now you have the miss kiss miss so you miss okay. the first one kiss or hit the second one nice. and you end up on the left side completely there's a new piece of barrier that's the braking point usually so here on the brakes and let go steering in for the right white wall and brake again yeah and aim towards the left curb right curb and the first traffic side on the left which is the 90 sign but someone folded it two weeks ago <laughs> and that's a bit annoying <laughs> yeah you stay left and after exclamation mark you start moving right and you stay close to the right curb still before the end of the curb you go on the brake so here on the brakes stay right stay right stay right now the left curb stone and then end of the white wall towards that and then back to the left side end of left curve stone tap on the brake and steer in and watch out when it's wet it's very slippery so you can take a bit more of the outside line yeah like that and here you can go flat out oh, oh, we keep approaching Lauda links where Nicky Lauda crashed in 1976 which marked the end of the Formula 1 era on the Norschleife yep uh, from here brake no 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 it's okay steering left staying left completely stay left at Yokohama sign you go on the brake and you stay left until the beginning of left curve so, so stay left stay left and now turn in yeah, and now the shot of yeah very late here accelerate out with the low powered cars such as 218 you can stay completely left for the lower <laughs> radius uh, so you can have the faster lap time obviously <laughs> but we're not but also for the safety it's very easy to stay left uh, of course you have to watch out for the, for the traffic yeah. you can count the curb stones we passed one this is two number three you go straight to the right side so you go straight and there's a car behind us and this left hander you can take uh, usually flat out depending on the car obviously but with most of the cars aiming to the right curb stone of the track and then left orange barrier yeah two more cars including the taxi and aerial atom Yeah, back to the inside. In the 
bottom completely, you go on the brake and stay right until the graffiti in the yellow one. And now turn it. side and then aiming straight to the 169 the fence in front of you stay close to the fence close to the fence and then left curb left curb after the jump you go on the brakes and end of curves and you see it stay left yeah. or before as well as okay. possible and then to the outside is possible to break after that yes well, well, with this car with this speed yes but if you go really fast you should break in the let go of the brake, do not to upset the ABS. End of curve stone steer in left, no need to brake, no need to lift. And end of left curve stone, you steer in right and as well, not necessary to brake. It was a bit of the early steering, but at the speed it was okay. Yeah, go straight here, right curve, there's a car behind us coming in fast, so watch out, stay right. Now good, going straight, aiming for the middle, and at the fence on the brakes, and going straight to the left side, like steering in. Right. Yeah, stay right, end of curve, so steer in left to the left curve, and the right side speed is okay. The right side, black marks on the right curve, and over there, that's your braking point, and end of curve, so steer in left, so brakes, and steer to the inside, yeah, and out, nicely done. Aiming towards the left side of the track, stay left, second graffiti is a braking point, and before end of curve, so you steer in, so you're on the brakes, yeah, and steer. And on the throttle towards the left side, left fence, 186, close to the fence, stay close to the fence. And now you can gently start steering to the right side of the track. Very nice line. And that's it, your first lap. Oh, wow. <laughs>